College football season officially starts this Saturday, August the 24th. Five games on the board. Four of them involve Division I teams. There's a mix of 1AA teams, FCS teams, and three of the five games. With zero, five official Division I football games this Saturday. And the late night game, right at midnight Eastern, will get a lot of betting action. Not because it's a high-profile game between Delaware State and Hawaii, but because... I don't want to call it the Degenerate Special, but hey, let's be realistic. It's the late night Degenerate Special. Good news, though, is I do think there's a money-making opportunity in this Delaware State-Hawaii football game late Saturday night. I'm going to give you that free play with analysis here in just a moment. Hi, this is Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com, right back here on Wager Talk TV. And college football starts this Saturday. Let's look at that late night game between Delaware State and Hawaii. Hawaii, a huge favorite, open 38 and a half this summer. And now, as we check the Wager Talk live odds screen, it's up to 40, even some 40 and a half starting to show. And Hawaii is a team that's actually gotten some sharp money this summer in some of the advanced lines. People do expect them to be improved. And I agree, I think they will be improved. It's the third season under head coach Timmy Chang. Chime! And it's his second full year with the run-and-shoot offense going full throttle. And he's finally getting his players in as well. And this is a high-octane passing offense, just like when he played there back in the day as quarterback. And that enables them to cover a big line. There's a few things we want to look for when we're laying a big number in college football. It's not a matter who's going to win this game. Spoiler alert, Hawaii's going to win this game. Delaware State is a miserable program. In fact, as I check the Wager Talk Live odd screen, there's not even money lines in many spots on this game because it's such a mismatch. And let's quickly talk about Delaware State. It's not a team we'll probably talk about at all the rest of the season. Uh, but they were 1-9 and nine straight up last year. Uh, they have an extended conference losing streak going back a couple seasons. They haven't even won a conference game in that awful conference that they're in and uh, in the MEAC. And this is also a team that does not look like they're getting any better. So the Hornets are in for another long season. They're a terrible team. So Hawaii can name their score here. So the question becomes, will Hawaii look to name their score? And I think there's several reasons they will. First of all, Hawaii hasn't struggled at the likes that Delaware State has, but they have struggled. In fact, uh, they've only been a favorite once or twice each of the past couple seasons. Uh, they've been nowhere close to this big of a favorite. So this is one of the rare opportunities, first time in several years, that Hawaii can really make a statement and go out there and route an opponent. Now, they do have UCLA on deck coming up. A little bit of a look ahead next week. That could be a concern, but I also think that's another reason they won't take their foot off the gas since this is a winnable game and they want to make a statement at home to start the season. Also, the fact that they're a high-octane uh, run-and-gun offense enables them to score quicker, more possessions equals more points, quicker scores, takes less time off the clock, and that also enables them to cover this big number. I'm always looking to lay big numbers in week one in college football. I've done extremely well for several years now playing big favorites in weeks, the first few weeks of the season in these non-conference games, and this is one of those situations you look for. A motivated home team that gets the chance to route a weaker opponent and has the offensive skill set to do so. If you're going to play it, you better lay it with Tim A and the Hawaii Rainbow Warriors. Warriors, whatever we can call them. I think we can't call them the Rainbow Warriors anymore. Anyway, minus the 40 points. This line's anywhere from 39.5 to 40.5, so shop around. Minus 40 Hawaii would be my recommendation for the late night game at midnight on late Saturday night, 11.59 p.m. Eastern Saturday night as we head into Sunday morning. Hey, if you're finding this analysis useful, give the video a thumbs up, a like, and don't forget to comment below. I read all the comments. I reply back. What are your thoughts on this game? What other games are you looking at here in week 1A, week 0, if you will, this Saturday in college football? I read the comments. I reply back. Don't forget, click subscribe and hit the bell for instant alerts. My college football top 25 weekly video starts next week. NFL Fade the Public weekly video starts the week after. So hit the bell for instant alerts. And also so you don't miss these daily free play videos for not only football, but baseball as well. Red Hot in baseball, number one ranked over the last seven and 30 days this week in baseball. Just a fantastic run in Major League Baseball. So don't sleep on baseball, even though football is here. And by the way, it's the 10th anniversary this weekend of the founder of wagertalk.com. And as a special offer, we have a fill your cart special every day for the next four days and nights through Sunday. And that gets you an instant 30% off anything you put in your cart. That can be a daily pick, a daily package or any All Sports All Access subscription, and you get an instant 30% savings when you use promo code 10YEAR. Once again, 10 years the promo code you got to use. It's quite simple. You put that in the promo uh, when you do the checkout for any All Sports package, or once again, any uh, daily package. You can use it every day and night, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And once again, you got to have promo code 10YEAR, 10YEAR, the number 10, and then year. 10YEAR gets you an instant 30% off Fill your cart for the next four days and nights through this Sunday night 
at wagertalk.com. And don't forget also check out my daily free baseball plays as well and free football plays every day on my page, Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. Get there quicker with shortcut wt.buzz slash sm. Follow me on Twitter on X at Steve Merrill, two R's, one L, at Steve Merrill on X. And stay tuned right here to Wager Talk TV for some more great free content coming up next.